good day everyone in this video today i will show you how to make a pie chart in google docs so to do this as you can see firstly here is a here is the data we are going to use for the pie chart the title will be subject scores of subjects and here are the subjects and the score right here we we'll just create a pie chart of four. Let me just add one to it to make it five. Um, Let me just add this one, okay? You can give it any number of your choice. So we are going to make a pie chart of five different subjects with their scores. So to do this, what you have to do, the first thing you have to do is just to scroll down. Then you go to where you want the pie chart to be. I want my pie chart to be right here. So when done clicking on where you want the pie chart to be, the so next thing for you to do is to click on insert. Then you scroll down to where you have the chart. So you can then scroll down, then click on pie. As you can see, the pie chart has been insert. So when done, you can then click on edit in sheets. But well, right now, I was unable to click on edit in sheet before it disappeared. And this is the chart right here. How do I edit it? So to edit it direct, because sometimes you might open this chart and this is what you will get. So you won't be able to edit it because you don't know how to do this. So to edit this chart, what you have to in sheet, to edit this chart in sheet, what you have to do is to just click on the chart. So when done, then you click on this arrow right here, and then click on Open Source. So a new tab will open, then it will be on Google Sheets. So it's loading, just give it time for it to finish loading. Just give it time for it to load. As you can see, it's still loading right here. So when, you are, when you're done with that, as you can see, the chart, it has been loaded. So let's scroll up, as you can see. Here is all what you have on the chart, which is this one here. As you can see, team 4, team 1, and every other thing, which is the same thing as this one right here. And here are the data that are inputted, that are input to the pie chart. So the next thing for you to do is just for you to enter the chart data. So right now, let's go to the top. If you have source score of subjects, so you can just copy it and if you don't have it on your pc you can just type it into the box so right now i'll just enter this one right here as you can see score of subject which is this one it has to change right here but it's not changing but let me just leave that one up because i'll go back to it later so let's go down here then enter the next data which will have the math sorry math then we just enter the data right here then we have 13 and just enter any of the data then the next one we have uh, english so let's just do this together i'll explain everything to you in this video so you can understand how the pie chart works on google docs so the fixes, let's go. Oh, let me type it right now. As you can see, you can also type it yourself. So the first one, 30, 30, 20, 20. Let me just enter it right here. 30, 20, 20. So right now we are done with all this thing right here but we have not input this one which is the economics so you can just copy it as you can see right here on the sheet there are a lot of paste just enter it paste then you give it its own which is uh, which is um 20 okay let's just enter it 20. So if you have more you can still go go down and enter it below and enter it below so right now as you can see as you are entering those stuff it's changing right here as you can see economics economics math physics 
English geography. So when done with this, how can we change this one right here to a point score? So let's come back here. Then we can reload it. So let's click on the chart. Then you can see update right here. So just click on update for it to update. So as you can see, here is the chart which has been updated. But here, right here, where we have the points called, is still the same thing instead of scores of subject. So to change this, what you have to do is just to come right here on the chart on the sheet. So what you have to do is just to double click on the chart. So when you double click on it, you will see this right here. So you can then change it to the score. So let's change it to score of subject. So, subject. so right now it has been changed. So let me just click outside the box. So if you come right here, then we update. As you can see, update. As you can see, scores of subject has been changed. So also you can change this color to any color. And again, all this one which we have right here, which is 30, 30, 20, it's not showing on this pie chart. So to add all these things to it, you have to go to this place right here again. So just click on the, you can double click on the chart, on the pie, on the image chart. So you can then come right here to this place. You can come right here. Then you can, you can also change the color, as you can see. Which is the color, you can choose any color of your choice. As you can see. You can change, you can select any color. If not, means give it any color of your choice. Um, orange, as you can see. So that is that for that. So let's move to the next one. So, also you can change this chart style, as you can see. You can select border chart border color, font. You can change the font style. You can change the background color. As you can see, there are different background color right here. As you can see. So it depends on what you want. You can also scroll down, then pie chart, click on pie chart. Um, border color, as you can see, border color, all this border right here. You can change the color to any one of your choice. As you can see, the border color has been changed. So you can just play around this. So, so, Choose what you want. As you can see, the percentage and the value. So let's just choose the value. As you can see, all these data right here, which I which I've typed here, 30, 30, 20, 20, 20. As you can see, that's the value which I which I have entered into the pie chart. So there are a lot of things you can just check around here. Click here. So okay. As you can see, there are a lot of things you can play with. Maybe on chart and as it's tied to, you can also change the title. Title test color. You can change it to any color of your choice. So you see the title of the test color will change. So there are a lot of features right here, which you can just play with yourself. Which you can play with yourself. So when done with all these, you can close this one and you go back to your Google Docs. So you update it, as you can see right here, update. So right now the chart has been updated. So as you can see, I've just created the chart on Google Docs and I've done some, and I've done a lot of editing on this chart. So that's how to do this, that's how to make a chart in Google Docs. Hope this video helped. Please give it a thumb up and don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. See you in the next video.